Okay, so still no contact back from Micah. I mean, we could follow up with a quick morning message. Mm -hmm. Good morning. Should I do Micah in quotes? Yeah. Please don't miss this opportunity to do the right thing. Okay, sent. All right, I'm gonna paste that same message I just texted into a Snapchat message. If this doesn't work, then we can message Cassandra and drop the hammer. But, uh, oh, wait a second. Whoa, whoa. Her little head just popped up. She just opened it, so she's, she just looked at it. Like, she's got her little head peeking. She's peeking. Oh, you saw that? She went away. Mm-hmm. Come on, girl. I'm gonna write her a new message. Just so you know, we spoke to and Zoomed with the real Micah. She is looking. Oh, she's typing, she's typing. <gasps> Here we go. Oh, she wrote something. Fine, I'm done with this anyway. I'll talk to you, but not old girl. She's saying she doesn't want to talk to Micah, right. but you want to use her photos for some right. coin? Well, here's what we can do. You got a lot of nerve. We can say okay. Now we can have Micah in the Zoom, but not like visible. Mm -hmm. So that she can see, and then when we want to, we can just bring her in. Yes. That nice is the trip. plan. Okay, great. Can you join our Zoom? She talking about, I'm done with this anyway. Girl. Oh, okay. What's the link? Great. But before we do that, we need to get Micah in here. That's true. Plot thickens. Hello. Hi. All right, so here's what happened. We messaged Cam, the Snapchat, you know, that Ryan's been talking to Micah on. And she said, fine, I'm done with this anyway. I'll talk to you, but not old girl. What? She got an attitude. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and what I think we should do is, you should be on the Zoom so you can see her. We can keep you a non-video participant so you can see and then at some point you can like jump back in. We have to have a code word and upon hearing that code word, you jump in, turn your sound on and your camera and be like, boom, bitch, hello. Cammy, you and I should have a chat thread going with Micah. So if you have any questions or things you want us to say to her, or if you're like, okay, oh, yeah. bring me in, bring me in. Like, mm -hmm. I need to The code will be pineapples. If you want to come in, just send the pineapple emoji. That's, that's the code. Okay, you want me to turn it off now? Yeah, I think you should, because I'm about to send her the link, okay? Here we go, here we go. All right, I sent it to her. I'm so excited. I added a little, oh. What's going on? Hi. Who the hell are you? Tony. Tony? Mm. Yeah. Huh. So, are you the person who's been Micah this whole time? Yeah. Wow. Mm. Interesting. Are you being for real? Yeah. Do you live in Detroit? No. Wait, if you don't live in Detroit, how did you have Micah's profile on Tinder in Detroit? I was in Detroit. Oh, you were in Detroit, okay. But you don't live in Detroit. Do you live in Michigan? Mm-hmm. Okay, so you're in the area. Okay, got it. Do you know a Cassandra Reed? Because that's the name that comes up when we ran your phone number. No. Are you a f subscriber to the real Micah's OnlyFans? I was. I kind of used her to make it seem a little more real, you know. It's actually, you know, a lesson. A lesson. Lesson? A lesson for who? My good man right here. It's a lesson for all the guys who own there. Man, you can't be sending money to these girls, to anybody on Snapchat, anybody you ain't never met in person or anything like that. If I, if I wouldn't have got you, somebody would have got you, you know. It's gonna get, it's gonna uh, happen. Interesting lesson you thought you would uh, teach. It's quite surprising. That's... Was it really surprising though, bro? Uh, a little bit, because I, I, I believe the story that was given to me, you know. Oh, you must be new on her. So have you used the Micah profile and, and, and Snapchat to like talk to lots of other guys? That ain't the only girl I use, no. Oh, okay, so use you plenty have- Use girls. But have you talked to any other guys the way you've talked to Ryan? 
What you mean? Well, I mean, you, we, Ryan sent you 500 bucks. Oh, yeah. So other other people sending you money too? Yeah. Wow. So wait, why when I called, was it a girl voice at one time? Oh, I had a girl answer. It was a couple of girls that I had talked to. Them. And do you cut them in on the on the cash? Of course. So you got like and a you, whole little this operation. This is like a business. I mean, I wouldn't call it a business. A lot of people do it, man. And how long have you been doing this? I don't know. So a long time. I didn't say that. So how long? I just said I don't know. Are you into guys? Never. But you're having sexual conversations with men in order to lure them to send you money? I'm a dude. I know what I know what a dude wants, you know? But what kind of lesson are you teaching him if you're also accepting the money? Don't you think that you're just as at fault as he is? I bet you it won't happen to him again. Don't send him some money. I should be the good guy because I'm coming out. Ain't nobody else gonna come out and tell y'all this. If you really wanted to teach Ryan a lesson, you know, you could have had him send you 50 bucks and then you could have said, hey, just so you know, I'm a, like, got you. But you kept it going and you probably would have kept it going longer if, you know, we weren't stopping it now. So like- But y'all ain't, ain't asked me like my whole plan, what I'm what I'm gonna do and stuff. I'm gonna pay the dude back. You can shoot me your cash app. I'm gonna send you that right back. You know, can we do that now? So, I mean, so, yeah, can you do it it's now? It's a lesson. No, we can't do it right now. You know, I'm a good dude. You know, it's just, it's a, it's a harmless scam. But you stole five hundred dollars from him. It's not harmless. You're putting the girl in the actual photos and videos at risk. That's where I have an listen, issue. Listen, because listen. say, say Ryan was crazy and ran into her somewhere and was like, hey, like you took this money from me, you never showed up. Now I'm gonna f you up. Now you put Micah, the real Micah, at risk. Girls put their self at risk when they post pictures of they self in the news. Period. Do you have kids? Don't worry about that. Well, I hope that you don't have daughters because if you do and somebody were to take advantage of them like that, I'm sure you would have an issue with that. My daughter won't be posting no pictures like that. There's so many guys taking these girls' pictures, making fake pages, doing all type of stuff. So you have to contribute? If I want to. That's so f***ed up. <laughs> That's so f***ed up. Where I'm at with these females, like now, like my baby mama that did so much to me, you know, a lot of girls that did a lot of a lot of to me, man. I these hoes, you know what I'm saying? Like, that is the most disgusting thing I have ever heard in my life. This lady right here, man, you a mother I am. You're damn straight. That I is hope a you fact. don't got no pics up like that. Absolutely not. But even if I did, that would be my choice and my prerogative as a woman. Who are you to tell women that they should expect to have their photos taken and shared to lure men for money? You're pissing me off. I do not mind at all. I think she's upset in yeah, a way she that a I... Female. Hey, bad mouthing her isn't going to help anything. Like I said, man, I came clean. I mean... Oh. Hey, Micah. Who the hell? Y'all tricked me. <laughs> so you really was into this. This was this was not just for fun. You wanted this money, you got a kick out of it. I don't know how many other girls you doing, but you using my face though. Like, it's one thing for me to do it, but I'm doing it knowing, knowing that I'm doing it. I'm not a hoe. Really? So if you wouldn't have been involved in the show, you wouldn't have came clean, because you keep saying, OK, I came clean. But you wouldn't have came clean if the show wouldn't have been involved. Like, look, real talk, when you doing like that, you know it's kind of expected. Like, if you don't know that little scam, everybody, that's that's little scam so old. You had to take his money, though. Like, I don't, I'm not understanding. I'm going to pay him back, though. That's What is he going to take, your word? Everybody do. It's really nothing. What's nothing though? Like what? What's what? You keep saying it's nothing. So many people do that. It's like it ain't. I don't see how y'all not thanking me. It should be like, damn, bro, you a real for so coming you feel clean like, you feel like, like that. Superman, because you taught him a lesson, but you took his money. What you are saying is hypocritical. I ain't talking to you. I'm not talking to you. You might as well get back off, bro. Go on, head on, bro. Real talk. I don't give a. Wait a second. If you did something wrong, like you gotta, you gotta take some heat, man. You can't just sit there and, and say, "Oh, I don't wanna, I don't wanna talk to her." If she's taking the time to talk to you at all, you could learn a lot from her. Maybe try listening and, and see what she has to say. As a woman, I cannot condone what has been going on because I think that you are putting women at risk. So I have to speak on behalf of that. But I think that you are taking it 
a certain kind of way because it's a woman asking you versus Neve asking you, but you don't have to respond. I think your silence is enough answer. You need to rethink your attitude towards women. You refer to girls on OnlyFans as hoes and they deserve it. It's just like basic respect. Cammy's trying to talk to you about some up you did. And you were like, you know what, forget it. I don't want to have that conversation. And you shut her down. And I don't know if that's because you didn't like the word she was using or if that's because she's a woman or if that's because- Yeah, she a female. You're a douchebag. There's this thing called morality and clearly it's something that you lack. Yeah, I don't even know what that means. Clearly, you should Google it. Yeah. All right, Ryan, anything from you? Uh, played me, you got me. Lesson learned, all that Uh, You said you'll pay me back, we'll see. That's really all I gotta say. <laughs> Free to see, bro. All right, I don't know if there's anything else uh, that I, I need to say. I ain't got no more talk either. Bye. Oh. Let me tell, is it? I'm just going to just. <laughs> We've never had two hopeless hook up, an identical twin. Everybody in Hawaii is in on this. <gasps> That's insane. We've never seen anything like this. The catfish sent you the real guy's Facebook page. Come on.